Hello everybody. So today I am doing a lip swatch video. I haven't filmed one of these in a while and I'm like really happy about this because I love filming these videos and I didn't really know what kind of lipstick range to do today. I have so many lipsticks that I really want to swatch one day but I thought today I would show you the NYX high voltage lipsticks because simply I haven't really seen that many people talking about these. I bought these off the NYX Cosmetics website a few months back. I have worn various shades of these in my tutorials before but I don't think I've actually just sat here and said like hey I like these a lot so I thought I would do this video. These are super pigmented, super moisturizing. I love the colors that are in this range so I'm gonna swatch them for you on my lips. If you are new to my channel please subscribe. I upload every Monday, Wednesday and Friday and leave me a comment down below. Let me know what lip swatch video you want to see next and let me know which one of these is your favorite too. Now I don't think I have every single shade here but I do have about 13 I think. So the color I'm wearing now is called Burlesque and I put this on before for the thumbnail. It is basically just a really beautiful kind of deep red. As you can see it kind of has like a glossy finish to it but I really really love the color. It's such a sexy red. Like really vampy and deep but it still has a touch of a bright red undertone to it. So if you're a red fan you need this. <laughs> so the first one I have here is called Mirage and this one is just a really nice pale like pink nude. So that is how Mirage looks on the lip. It is a very pale, pinky, like milky nude. You are fair, it's a really good one, or if you just like that really dramatic nude look. It's also really, really good to mix with other colors, which is what I have used it for in the past. A note on the staying power of these lipsticks, they're not amazing. They do last really well if you pair them up with a lip liner, but on their own, because they are quite creamy and they're really, really like thin in their texture, they don't last for like hours and hours and hours. I really like the applicator because it's nice and small, so it's just easy to slap on. I do not mind touching up and I just love the finish. I love a good creamy lipstick. So again that one is Mirage. Next up is the shade Stone and this is kind of like a slightly grey nude. Like a greyish. <laughs> I do have to say for some reason this one doesn't wind up which is really weird. It must be like a faulty packaged one. But the actual color is really pretty. Like I said, it's that kind of like gray beige, grayish color. Really on trend at the moment. Very 90s, very Kylie Jenner if you like that kind of look. I really like it. Next up is the shade called Tangerine. And this one is like a tangerine nude kind of color, like a peachy nude. I love this color combination of like my eye makeup and the lip color. This lip color is so beautiful. If you love a good nude and you love a good peach, it's like the perfect balance. These lipsticks feel so good on your lips. They're very moisturizing and very like thin. Like you can't even feel them. They're not heavy. They don't go cakey on your lips. I love how this one looks. This is definitely a favorite of mine. I'm just going to zoom in a little bit. I'm sorry. I'm quite far away. I didn't think about that. Next, let's do this shade here. It is called Pink Lady. This one is just a really nice like bright kind of pink. I don't even think that the camera can like pick up how bright this color is. If you love bright, like bold, almost neon colors, like this is super neon. It's just the perfect bright pink. It's not dark, but it's still really bright and it packs a punch. This is like the perfect summer lipstick. <laughs> Next shade is called French Kiss and this one is actually like one of my favorites. It's just really easy to wear like day to day. It's just the perfect kind of soft baby pink without being too pale. A lot of baby pinks kind of look really like weird I feel but this one's really really pretty. It's very soft looking but it's still got that like soft punch of color in it as well. So yeah again that one there is called French Kiss. Next up I've worn this one so many times. I think I wore it in a tutorial as well and I think I wore it in my four eyes look for Halloween as well. This is called Beam and this one is like a neon coral. So that is how Beam looks. It's really, really bright. I said it was like a coral, but it's not really. I think I'm thinking of a different color. It's just like a really bright pink. Really neon. It's kind of similar to the other one I swatched a couple shades ago, but a little bit darker. Next up, we're going to do the shade Tiara. And this one is a little bit of a darker kind of uh, darker pink. <laughs> It's a little bit more like peachy. This one here is probably one of the more wearable shades. Like you could wear it with a lot of different makeup looks. Not as bright and vibrant as some of the other shades. So again, that one is called Tiara. Next up we have the shade Free Spirit, which is a really beautiful, like vibrant orange color. I love this one. It's so cool. Maybe not with this makeup. 
This color is perfection. It is amazing. Everybody needs this color. It is so so vibrant like you can see that for yourself it is so cool pair it up with like a nice bronze smoky eye heaven i think i need to use this in a tutorial it's so pretty next we will do a hot pink this is the brightest pink i have it's called privileged so that there is privileged it's such a bright pink it's more of like a fuchsia pink such a barbie color <laughs> i really like it again such a good summer color next up i have the shade rockstar which is another red except this one is more bright than the one i was wearing at the beginning of this video so that's how it looks it's just a perfect like classic red it's a little bit bright as well but just such a nice color you could wear it day or night i would say it's more of like a pin-up red like a really bright vibrant red i don't know if that makes any sense at all but yeah that is rockstar next up we have the shade flutter kiss interesting name it's kind of like a pinky brown color so that's what flutter kiss looks like it's quite a unique kind of color it's like purpley pinky brown all at once it's actually quite a nice color just for daytime if you paired it up with like just like black eyeliner or something i feel like it would look really nice so yeah that is flutter kiss flutter kiss flutter kiss and then our last shade is definitely the darkest it's called dirty talk i like that name <laughs> and it is basically like a really dark brownie color oh <sighs> I love brown lipstick. It's This is like the most perfect brown lipstick I have. This has got to be one of my favorites as well. I really, really like it. It's just the most perfect, rich chocolate brown color. If you need a good chocolate brown lipstick color, I recommend this one. It's really pretty. Again, that's called Dirty Talk. So I hope you guys enjoyed these lip swatches. Let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite. I definitely need to pick up the rest of this collection just in case it is going to be discontinued one day or anything. Hopefully it won't be because they are really good for a really good price as well. So I hope this video helped. Let me know if you've tried these before as well. I will talk to you guys again really, really soon. Please thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it and I will talk to you. Wait, I just said that. Anyway, <laughs> bye! Hey everyone, so today's tutorial is on this makeup look that I'm wearing right now. So smoky and sultry, I feel like it's the perfect makeup look to wear whenever you want to feel sexy and confident. So basically it's just super smoky eyeliner, a little bit of pink glitter, super glowing skin, and pretty pink glossy lips.